Hey, hey, Brian Sensei here. In this video, I'm going to show you how to take an image and turn it into a talking avatar using AI. Let's dig in. Okay, so the first thing we're going to do is come on down and open our favorite internet browser. And then we're going to head on over to the HeyGen website. You'll find a link to the website in the description below. Once here, you're going to want to click on Get Started for Free, and you'll want to create your account and get signed up. Once you're logged in, you're going to come on over to the far left and look for Video Avatar. Click here. Now, a little bit below that, we're going to see Photo Avatar. Let's click in here. You'll notice that you have a variety of existing images that you can utilize to create a talking avatar, but you can also upload your own image or you can use AI to generate your own image. Let's try this out. Down here, we can describe the photo we're looking for. In this case, I want to create an image that looks similar to Jim Morrison from one of my favorite rock bands, the doors. Break on through to the other side. Break on through to the other side. Break on through to the other side, yeah. And we will click generate. Okay, not bad. We have some results that look very similar to Jim Morrison. Please note that you are not allowed to upload pictures of actual celebrities and famous people. I think I like this first one the most, so I will go ahead and unselect these and save. All right, the avatar has been saved to my library. I'll go ahead and close this window, and there he is. All right. Now, here you'll notice we have two options. We can create the video with this avatar in landscape or portrait. I'm going to go ahead and use the portrait option here. All right, now from here, you're gonna see down on this timeline, we have the photo itself, and below that, we have the message that the avatar will read. To view this message, we're gonna come up over here to the top left, and we're gonna to go to script. All right, so here you can see the field where you can use the existing script or type your own. In this case, I'm gonna write my own custom message. Okay, above that, we're going to see our voice options. We can click here, and we see all these voices that we can choose from. In this case, I need a male voice. So over here, I'm going to change the filter to male. All right, now we can go through and listen to these voices and select the one that I like the most. Hello, this is how I sound. Hope you like it. Hello, this is how I sound. Hope you like it. Hmm, that kind of sounds similar to Jim Morrison. I'm going to go ahead and utilize this one. Now we can go ahead and play it back here. Welcome to Brian Sensei's School of Rock, where you can learn to be a rock star just like Jim Morrison of The Doors. Now, you'll notice that the video continues even though the avatar has stopped speaking. So what we can do is we can adjust the length of these by simply dragging them in. All right. And you may have noticed that the avatar was not moving its mouth to simulate the talking. That's simply because in the preview, you will not be able to see that, but you will see it in the final production of your video. Additionally, if you like, you can add elements to your video, such as text, or you can add other elements, such as stickers, icons, etc. In this case, I'm happy with the video, so let's go ahead and title our video. And over here on the far right, we're going to click Submit and submit again. Over here, you'll see that the video has been submitted and it was in a queue there, and now it is being processed. All right, it looks like it is finished. I'm gonna go ahead and play this and let's check it out. Welcome to Brian Sensei's School of Rock, where you can learn to be a rock star, just like Jim Morrison of The Doors. <laughs> Whoa. 
That's awesome. I love this video. I'm going to go ahead and download this. Over here on the right, you're going to see download options. And notice here, you can also translate your video into different languages. Pretty cool. All right, so I'm going to download it at 720p. If I wanted 1080p or higher, I would need to upgrade my subscription, but I'm gonna go ahead and stay with the 720p and I'll download the original video. I'll go ahead and open the folder where this downloaded and here it is. Now I can use this video to help promote my school of rock. If you wanna see more of these videos, consider subscribing to my channel and click the notification button so you can be notified every time I post new videos. If you have a specific tech tip you'd like me to create, please let me know by completing the form in the description below. And I'll see you on the next one.